Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley says his government is looking at how best it can legally address the THA deadlock. He was speaking at today's post-cabinet media briefing. Akinla Beholder tells us more. Prime Minister Rowley said that he has been in contact with the Attorney General and Senior Counsel Advice through the Attorney General's office to find a resolution to the six-all deadlock. I had been in touch with the Attorney General and Senior Counsel by way of the Attorney General to determine what is the nature of the problem, how is the problem likely to evolve, and how it can be rectified as the relevant aspects of that evolution takes place. The second step took place today. We had the president swearing in those who were elected on election day. The Prime Minister said that the THA Act is very specific and the steps are spelled out in the Act. He, however, said that the legal advice he has allows him to wait. Just like the Parliament regulates its own business, the Tobago House of Assembly, being a Parliament, regulates its own business and we have to wait and see how they do it going forward. And they may get to a position one way or the other. They may solve it. They may solve it without recourse to others. Or they may require recourse to something else. Dr. Rory said that he does not suspect that the impasse would last for years and he trusts that all parties in Tobago will realize what has to be done. And if the parliament is required, the government stands ready to approach the parliament to fix whatever problem exists with the Tobago parliament. There's no deadline elsewhere, like say at the parliament or the government, to tell this assembly to hurry up or to get it done by any particular day. So uh, they will have to assemble themselves and see how much good sense will prevail. Akinla Beholder, Channel 5 News.